wanna be on top. and welcome back to another episode of American Girls Next Doll Model. I'm sorry this one is late, but I was in New York City from Friday through Sunday and I got home really late last night, so I could not record. And also, I didn't have the, um, the photos to pre-record um, the video on, on Thursday. So there's that. Um, but let's get right into it. You guys have been telling me you're so excited to see the new episodes and that means a lot to me. So week six. Celebrity week, let's get started. The first photo is from Adelaide, and I think this is so cute, and I love everything about this photo. I love how the different lighting, and um, I'm gonna stick her inspiration pictures down here as well. So, her photo, inspiration photos, and um, I think you executed it perfectly, and I love uh, like the look of this photo. I maybe would have added a little bit de more detail to her jacket like it was in the first inspiration picture, just because it would have added a little bit more interest, but I think it's really good, and I love how the stars in her buns and everything looks great. Nice job. The next photo is from Arden. I think this is really cool. It looks like she's casting a spell. The blue tint is a little bit too much, um, and I think her sweater should have been black instead of purple because it just kind of makes her blend in with the background and the foreground. So maybe if all of her clothing was different colored, it would make her stand out more. And I don't know that much about Harry Potter, so I don't know if her jacket is purple in the movie, but I think just for the sake of the photo, I maybe would have made it black I, just to separate her from the background foreground. But other than that, great job. The next photo is from Ashley. I love this photo and I love the red carpet scene. It looks like a real red carpet and I love the paparazzi, the little fence in between them, the backdrop that says La La Land on it. That's so cool. Um, her outfit is really cute and looks just like Emma Stone's outfit. Um, but I do like that you mixed it up a little bit because you gotta get your own creativity going. Um, the background is perfect. Great job. The next photo is from Lauren. This photo is really cute. I like that you took the time to create the backdrop and print everything. Um, however, I would have edited between the um, the lines in between the papers because it's a little bit distracting. Um, and I think you could have paid a little bit more attention to detail because it doesn't really remind me of the celebrity you picked right when I look at it. Um, and maybe would have done something to do with her personality or maybe even her as Rue in the Hunger Games. I think it would make the photo a lot better. Um, it just kind of looks like she's just standing on maybe on like a photo, a red carpet, but there's also no paparazzi and it's just kind of her there, so um, that's just something to look out for. Next photo is from Maddie Sage. I really like this photo, it's super cute, and I really appreciate that you went out in public to take pictures because that takes some guts, and I'm glad you did. Um, she looks really cute and like she's shopping, she's just really cute, and I also love the lights in the background, it creates a nice little um, Okay, fact. Maybe would have had her interact with some items to make it look more candid rather than she's posing because, you know, when celebrities go out, they don't really pose for pictures. It's just kind of them doing stuff. But other than that, great job. Uh, the last photo is from Natalie. I think you did a great job recreating this photo from the music video. And the outfit is spot on and you definitely pay attention to a lot of the small details, which of course I always appreciate. However, it is a little bit more pixely than your previous photos and I don't know what, what the cause of that is but it's definitely a lot lower quality some things that could be changed in editing and I know you said that you your Lightroom trial ended or something so that could be the cause of it but um this is what she had to work with but I think it's really cute and you did a great job anyway so now it's time for best to bottom two best photo this week goes to Ashley um, next is Adelaide Maddie Sage Natalie and the bottom two are Lauren and Arden. Both of your photos were so great. I wish I didn't have to eliminate you guys, one of you, um, but unfortunately I do because that's how the show works. So um, to Lauren, I think your photo was cute, but again, it just didn't really scream your celebrity to me. It just kind of looked like 
Lauren was the celebrity in general, if that makes sense. Um, like, I feel like you could have added, like, the nose ring right here. Um, you had the hoops, which was good, but I think just some other small details were missed. Um, to Arden, I think your picture is really cute. It definitely reminded me of Emma Watson, but again, I think the blue was a little bit too much. Um, I think it would have been great. It does give me, like, magical vibes, but it would be great if your doll stood out from the picture rather than blending in, if you know what I mean. So, the person who is going to be eliminated this week is... Lauren, I'm sorry Lauren, you did an amazing job in this competition and I really enjoyed watching you improve and grow and you were a great candidate for this and I think you still did an amazing job so don't be too hard on yourself. Um, but here are all of Lauren's past photos. So to the five remaining, that is crazy, there's only five people left, oh my gosh, okay. So to the five remaining contestants, next week's theme is going to be your home country slash state. Um, I know a lot of you are in the US, so um, if you live in the US, you can represent your state. If you're allowed to say it, I know some people aren't allowed to say it, but then that's also, if you can't say your state, then that's where you could say your country. So. Um, represent your country or state. I know we have um, Ashley from Italy, so that will be cool. And yeah, so I'm excited to see what you guys come up with. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!